Yes. So you know how they had the gold standard, right? And then the dollar bill was, it was backed by gold. And now they have, now they have cryptocurrency and that's backed by the, the, the belief that people have. And I think that it reminded me that I need that gold standard. Like I need the, the basis of my faith to be backed by God. And it, you know, when your faith is backed by your neighbor <laughs> or backed by your wife even, or your kids, you know, there's gonna be a point where they let you down because they're not meant to be the base, the basis of your faith. So as a, as a believer, it reminded me that my provider has always provided and always will provide even when I wasn't able to provide for myself. Like he provided people. He provided people that did things for me. And that was nothing I decided. It's just, he's always provided. And um, not just people, but resources. I don't give myself that credit because then I have to own up to continuing to be my provider. And I, I can't, I can't do it without God always providing and, and making up for the gaps. Even where I, I'm super technical and can come up with, um, you know, the, the answer. So I think as, as far as being a dad, you know, I, I want to showcase what patience looks like, um, what waiting looks like. I'm normally like, hey, okay, let's figure it out. Let's do something. It's, sometimes it's so hard to wait. And sometimes during the waiting, then you can kind of question, well, what am I waiting for? I don't see anything, it's not clear. And, um, but the waiting is a time that, you know, I, <laughs> I could spend in prayer and ask God, instead of think we have a bad habit of going on Google for the answer. <laughs> and, um, and it's like, well, the connector and the provider of everything that I have, why not ask him? And I've had way more peace in waiting for what the result was versus trying to produce the result. And that may just be more of my, my work background. But when you're out of work, you know, that's another moment where you, the exalted was humbled. The, the man that was the sole provider, the one income of the house that had no worries about his job, lost the job like that. And it was a big reminder like, okay, I didn't give myself the job. I didn't put myself in a position to, you know, be hired for this job. You know, and everything that, that we have and everything that I have, I believe is because of God, it's not because of me. And I just have way more peace with waiting than I used to. <laughs>